the fight between Natali Trikalova from the red corner and Veronika Smolkova from the blue corner. Czech Republic versus Slovakia. And it's a 61.2 kilograms MMA final. So Veronika Smolkova and Natali Trikalova know each other quite well because Trikalova was the bronze medalist of the World Championship in Amsterdam and Smolkova won gold at the same championship uh, in last March. And also Veronika Smolkova has already won a gold medal in a striking MMA division here in Belize. So now she's trying to, to become the double champion here, the same as Alexandra Karasova already did as Ukrainian fighter won two gold medals. Controls the center of the ring quite well, throwing the punches, leg kicks. And her movement is a little bit faster than her opponents. Good inside leg kick. Two minutes. It's a medium fight in which oh, I just wanted to say that it's a slight advantage of of Smolkova, but it was a very good punch by Trikalo. And again, now now Smolkova is attacking, and, and it's a very very close and intense fight. Good. Good attack. Knee to the body from the clinch from Smolkova. Trikalova fights back and lands a couple shots himself. So we were shown that it was a low blow from Czech fighter. But now Veronica needs to recover. She said that she's ready, ready to continue. And that's the end of the first round. Second round, Natalia Trikalova versus Veronika Smolkova. Czech Republic versus Team Slovakia.
So all three judges gave the first round in favor of Slovakia. Slovakian fighter, and as you can see, in the second round, she's more active. She's she's going straight to action, like from <laughs> from the first second, and now she's working from the top, and uh, she trapped the opponent in the corner, trying to trying to unload the ground and pound attack. So that's a good, good attack from Veronika Smolkova, and we've already seen that's that's the way that uh, Alexandra Karasova won her respective final just a couple fights ago. So anything is possible. Maybe the fight will be finished right here. And whoa, good, good switch to the full mount. Veronika works actively from the top. Here you can see is where experience matters. And uh, Veronika is a very, very experienced fighter. And, and now she's so confidently working. Oh, and that's a, that's a ground and pound that can end this fight. Very, very good attack. Very good attack, and it seems like maybe it's a few more punches in this fight can be stopped. But no, 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 no. Not yet. Natalie Trikalova defends. Defends as effectively as she, as she can. And now, now Veronika Smolkova is trying to trap her opponent's arm in between the legs and uh, make an arm bar. And uh, didn't succeed with that. But I think that, yes, this is round ends right now. And I think it's pretty clear about who is the winner of this round. So the third and final round of the fight between Natalie Trikalova and Veronika Smolkova. Trikalova is in a red corner, Smolkova is in a blue corner. So as we can see, Veronika Smolkova is on her way to, to become the double Gamma European champion, both in MMA and striking MMA. And uh, these titles she can add to her world championship gold that she earned in Amsterdam at the Gamma World Championship last, in last March. So as we see, uh, Veronika Smolkova is undefeated at Gamma events so far and now she's on her way to another victory. Not an easy task at all for her opponent to 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 prevent to prevent Veronica from from becoming the, the champion in this discipline. One and a half minutes. 
half minutes left. See, it's so, so confident, so, so confidently, the, the work, the work of the, the world champion, Veronika Smolkova, and even though her opponent is not new to this sport, and she is a bronze medalist of the world championship, but she doesn't have just anything to just, just to defend this attack. So it seems like the second gold medal will go to Veronika Smolkova and Team Slovakia. And it's the last, last 30 seconds. There is some problem about the tape on the gloves. So I believe that it's gonna be fixed fast. But it gives the fighters a little bit of time. Maybe to recover, maybe to about the tactics maybe now it will be oh and it's a, it's a good start good start from Natalie Trikalova but yes look she's very active she's got nothing to lose and now she's going all out she's going all out and she's pretty successful with that so it just left me wondering why she didn't do it before because that was the by far the best attack of Natalie Trikalova in this in this fight and you see she's fighting back and she's landing punches okay not not of them are clean not of them are landed but it was a good good attack and good good final seconds of the fight by natalie trikalova so we obviously need to give her credit by what she was doing in this fight but yeah i think this time veronika smolkova is just we're, we're just better in, in this competition and it means that she will become double gamma european champion here in Belize.